What is going on guys? This is Iron Noobs coming back at you with this week's weekend update for Neverwinter October 25th. So we're going to go ahead and start off with console this week for PlayStation and Xbox One. Y'all are having a two times experience event. So if you need to level some companions or level some alts, this is the weekend to get double experience. You also have 20% off companions. So if you've been looking to get a companion... This is the weekend if you want it out of the Zen market to receive 20% off of your companion. Uh, make a note that all companions will receive double XP even if you are level 70. So that's pretty nice if you're trying to get some new companions or just trying to level some alts like I said. For the patch notes over on the consoles, there's quite a bit of patch notes. Uh, some of the main things that I noticed that y'all may be interested in, uh, a lot of stuff in Barovia was changed, such as your weekly company of wolves. Players can no longer get the quest stuck by splitting up. Your uh, players can no longer catch fire when standing on a campfire near the Vistani encampment. I don't know if people were having problems getting caught on fire or what was going on there. Castle Ravenloft uh, for the achievement ghost stories all three ghosts now spawn per dungeon run rather than just randomly choosing the same one each time so I guess that's going to help for you achievement hunters out there also in Castle Ravenloft the pillars in the center of the sisters of straw boss fight have been removed and then it states the sisters of fury had asked for a better line of spite so I don't know if that was a pun created there or if it was a typo and supposed to be line of sight most likely probably a pun um uh there's there's tons of stuff that's going to uh in the patch notes tome of the nine gods tons of dinosaurs no longer spawn at once in a pit so i guess that's going to help y'all out from getting killed um basically uh the other big thing that i saw for consoles was the master spellplate caverns msp um when nestora is pushed to another phase too quickly then class planner prominence uh, then is reduced to zero hit points while finishing her ultimate attack. She no longer keeps the arena deadly after her defeat, but she does reset the encounter after defeat, meaning players will have to defeat her again. So those were some of the big things that I noticed in the patch notes for console players for Xbox and PlayStation 4. Over on PC, we're having a two times guild marks event. So if you've been saving up your influence and things like that, such as I have, uh, now is the time to cash them in for your two times guild marks. Honestly, um, I'm probably going to go ahead and still buy maps and hope that materials aren't going to like hugely crash with the mod 15 so it's just something that i'm going to risk myself personally also we have 20 percent off of the stronghold category in the zen market so if you've been wanting some stronghold lock boxes and stuff like that uh, to be able to help your guild grow that may be something that you're interested in Coming in on the mounts, we have a 20% off all mounts in the Zen Market. Keep in mind that if you do buy a mount from the Zen Market, you will be able to redeem it on all characters. So if you've got 50 alts and you buy a mount in the Zen Market, you'll be able to redeem it on all 50 characters. So that's nice. And then last but not least, a 15% off VIP sale. So there wasn't nothing really big in the patch notes for PC this week. Um, other than that, that's going to be your weekend for Neverwinter. Also, stay tuned. Uh, I am currently working on a Neverwinter Astral Diamond series where I'm going to go from 1 mil to 10 million Astral Diamonds. And basically, you'll be able to follow along with me to possibly reenact what I'm doing to be able to get some nice Astral Diamonds. So if y'all did like the video, be sure to hit that like button for me. Subscribe if you are not subscribed. Share this with everybody you know. And... We will see you next week for next week's update. I hope y'all do enjoy the update this weekend. Also, didn't want to forget the Masquerade of Liars, obviously, is going on, the Halloween event. I believe it will be going on until November 6th. So enjoy that and go get that broom out. Until the next one, this is Iron Noobs, saying peace.